The number of Americans giving up their citizenship has risen considerably this year. But why this is happening has yet to be determined. Americans that renounced their U.S. citizenship jumped six-fold in the second quarter of 2013. More than 1,130 cases have been registered, compared to only 189 cases in the same period last year. Experts speculate that new tax laws to be implemented next year are the cause for this spike. The culprit is believed to be the Foreign Accounts Tax Compliance Act, which is meant to recover unpaid taxes from Americans overseas, estimated at $100 billion per year. But one American citizen who has attempted three times to revoke his citizenship states there are other reasons as well. I've been contacted over the years with uh, quite a few people who have either uh, renounced or are really thinking about renouncing, and none of them expressed the, the reasons uh, that I've seen in some articles about um, you know, tax reasons for doing so. I've, I've been contacted by many Americans who feel very much like I, I have, and that is that I, I really want no part of what the United States is doing. Ken O'Keefe is an Irish citizen who attempted on three occasions to renounce his American passport on moral grounds mainly in opposition to the military policies of the United States government. O'Keefe says his first and second attempts at renunciation in 2001 were denied by the U.S. government because he didn't hold any other citizenship. Upon obtaining his Irish citizenship, O'Keefe requested that his American one be given up again in 2004, but was again denied, this time without explanation. A State Department spokeswoman told Press TV that they cannot discuss O'Keefe's case due to privacy laws. But the bottom line is, you have to have some sort of allegiance to a country to genuinely be considered a citizen. And I do not have enough, any allegiance to the U.S. government, so therefore I am not a U.S. citizen. But if you ask the U.S., they will tell you otherwise. Unlike some other nationalities, Americans pay taxes to both the U.S. and as citizens of the countries they live in. Experts state that with the added burden of more stringent tax laws, citizenship renunciation may become more common. 